my channel. I hope you all are doing really well. It has been a little while since I filmed or posted anything. I think it's been like almost a month. I had some personal stuff happen, so I took some time away and kind of just focused on that. But I thought it was now time for me to start filming and putting up videos again because I have missed it. So I thought today I would do a fashion video. It is going to be my week in work outfits. So basically what I have worn for the last week. Um, I've got them hanging up here and I'm going to have cutaways of how I wore them, the shoes, bags, everything that goes with it. And I will just talk through them here. So I'm going to start off with the outfit that I wore today. So the outfit that I've got on today is basically a knit from Uniqlo. This is my go-to knit. On my rack you will see I have two more. Basically I just have them in a navy, white, and multiple black ones because this is my go-to for winter. It works really well like if you need to layer underneath like blazers or underneath other tops just to keep you a little warmer. So I love these and the thing about these that I love is they're pretty inexpensive. You can get them for about 30 Australian dollars and I've got it paired with a Hugo Boss skirt. It's a bit hard to show you here but it is in the cutaway. I do love the skirt so I got it on sale a couple months ago at the Hugo no, that's a lie. I went to the Hugo Boss store and actually saw this skirt and another one. And I loved it so much. But the sizing at Hugo Boss is a little bit weird. I usually wear a size 6 and the size 6 was too big. I tried on a size 4 and it was too big. So I don't know what why the sizing is weird. But I found a smaller size on Bloomingdales.com and I just went for it. It was also on sale. So they got shipped from America and I'm so happy with them. This outfit with this knit and skirt I've paired with my Gucci Jordan loafers. Love these loafers so much. They are such a great purchase, honestly. Definitely, this will be in my best purchases of the year. I love these loafers so much. So comfy, so easy to wear, and so easy to pair. The bag I paired this outfit with is my go-to Celine belt bag. If you've been following me, you know I bought this bag recently when I started my new job. And I absolutely love it along with the Gucci Jordan loafers. Two best purchases of the year. Two best work purchases ever. This bag literally fits a million things and it is just my favorite bag. This kind of outfit, like a, this top and skirt with my Gucci loafers, uh, my go-to outfit for a day where I don't have meetings. I'm going to be in the office pretty much all day. And it's more of like a casual, relaxed outfit rather than a super professional work outfit. It's work appropriate, but it's not super professional I guess. So I go for this outfit when I've got kind of a long day happening, um, when it's either like a long day or I know I'm going to be at the office and just doing a lot of work. I want something comfortable. The skirt is not too tight so I can sit comfortably. I can walk around easily. The next outfit is this blazer. So you've probably seen this in a few videos. I think this would probably be one of my favorite blazers that I have. Um, this is from Forever New and why I love this blazer is just got a really nice fit. So this belt really cinches in your waist and the blazer is slightly long so it kind of makes you look taller if you wear heels with it and it's just a nice shape. Beneath this I just wear a knit because it's still cold here so it's just easy no fuss and I just put on this blazer and I'm ready for the day. A easy kind of outfit where I don't really have to think about it and I just pop on a pair of black pants. These are again from Forever New. I am looking for a really nice work pant. So I've been struggling to find high-waisted pants that are also cropped. I hate going to the tailor. I'm the worst. So if it's too long for me at the shop, I'm just not even going to bother to buy it just because I'm, I just don't like going to the tailor. When you're working nine to five, you really don't have the time to go to the tailor. And it's just, it's a hassle. So I'm just trying to find like a really nice pair of pants. Honestly, I'm at the point now where I would spend like a lot of money just to get a good pair of pants. These are like these are good, but they're not high-waisted enough for me. So when I wear shirts with them, I have to constantly tuck them. But they're actually really good for short people because this is from the petite range. And these actually sit on my ankles. So I really like them. These I like to wear with blazers that are a little bit longer because I don't have to worry about like my shirt coming out untucked. So this is kind of like my go-to. So I paired that outfit with my black Gianvito Rossi heels. So these are suede. And I think these are the 100 millimeters. So these are not 
the most comfortable. I do want to get a similar black pair that are maybe a little bit more comfortable, probably with a thicker heel. But they are my black heels, so I do wear these when I need to wear heels. And they need to be black. When I've got black pants, then I tend to wear these. So these are the black heels that I go for every time I need to wear some black heels. And they aren't the most comfortable, but they're not super uncomfortable where I'm dying. Obviously, if I'm walking a ton, they will die, but I can walk to meetings across the city once a day and be fine. I have had to go to multiple meetings in this and my feet have died, but one meeting across the city, possibly catching the tram, is a little bit better for my feet, but I wouldn't recommend these if you're gonna be at work walking a lot. If you're at your desk, this is fine. And the handbag I paired it with is my Dolce & Gabbana Sicily bag. I know Dolce & Gabbana is a little like up in the air about their, you know, their belief. I've had this bag for a long time now. It's like maybe four or five years old. I don't like what Dolce & Gabbana stands for, but I do really love this bag. And I just think it looks like really professional. And it's like one of my smaller black handbags that I can take to work when I don't really have a lot of stuff. Um, I like that the logos are also like really small and you can't really tell that it's Dolce. Um, let's talk about my favorite work outfit ever. It's actually the newest work piece in my wardrobe. And it's a set that I purchased from Country Road and I'm in absolute love with it so it is this here so this is the compact knit jacket i think and i absolutely love it so i got it in a navy and i got the matching skirt for it so this is the compact knit skirt so this is past the knee all my work skirts tend to be past the knee i feel like for me that's the kind of professional look that i like to go for and i love the navy blue i would have loved to have got it in black as well but i thought i don't know navy blue is like black just with just a little bit more fun. I don't know. It's like black, but not as boring to black. This jacket is my absolute favorite thing ever. The two together, I just absolutely love. And it's got a peplum shape at the bottom. So the tighter you tie it, the more it will stick out. I will say from the front, it does stick out a little bit more, but I don't mind. I really like the way this looks. And it's also got some padding here at the top to give your shoulders a little bit more definition. Underneath this, I just wear a navy blue knit. I come in a green as well, like a like a moss green and black and that's it. I really want the green but there's also a really nice green one at Sabre so I'm like deciding which one I should go for. I wish I could buy this in every color. I mean I probably am going to get it in the green as well just because I love it a lot. Also for those I went with my black heels as well. I would actually like to get a pair of navy blue heels as well and then for the bag again same Celine Bell's bag that I love. Okay, moving on to another outfit that I wore. I wore this blue dress from Q. So this I wore with stockings and my Chanel ballet flats. This was just one of those days where I could not be bothered getting dressed up. I woke up really late and I just threw this on. In our office, it can get really warm. So I didn't wear like a jacket or a blazer or anything. It was a day where I didn't have meetings. So I just wore this. This for me is probably more of a summer outfit I would probably stick to wearing this in the summer but I was just having one of those days so I just threw this on with stockings and some ballet flats and I was good to go. I love this little black and white pattern. I think this will go really nice in the summer with some heels as well. On that day I took my Louis Vuitton briefcase just because I had my laptop that I had to carry so whenever I have to carry my laptop I tend to take this bag and I try not to wear it with prints so I'm very particular about the outfit that I'll wear if I have to carry this bag. So this bag is only carried when I need to take my laptop or else I tend to um, stick to my other bag. This is a practical bag for me. So this is the last outfit I wore this week, another skirt from Hugo Boss. This is also a skirt that I got on sale. I got these two together at the same time from Bloomingdales.com. This again, very weird sizing with Hugo Boss. I had to go like two sizes down, which I don't know why. I do love this, the way these two skirts look, but I have to admit they are a pain for creasing. Both materials are quite different and both of them require a lot of ironing. I noticed that I'll wear this and if I've just sat for a little bit, it will all be creased like through the skirt. And I just, I kind of don't like that. I feel like I look messy when I'm going to meetings, but I do wear this at two meetings. I just wish, you know, the material was a little bit nicer. I paired the skirt with this cream knit from 
Uniqlo again, just an easy simple top with a patterned skirt. This outfit I paired with my Christian Louboutin heels. So comfortable. I'm not even joking, these are so comfortable. If I have the option when I'm going for meetings, I will try to pick an outfit where I can wear these shoes because they're really easy to walk in. I can walk to multiple meetings, I can walk throughout the day, and it's all because of this really nice thick heel. This is 85 centimeters as well, so it's not as high, so I think it's a perfect shoe for work. If you're looking for a Christian Louboutin heel for work, this is amazing. The red's actually holding up pretty well. I thought it would be um, doing a lot worse by now. Funnily enough, my Prada handbag almost perfectly matches these shoes. So I always like to wear these together when I get the chance. This was my first ever handbag, so it's really special. And I love that I get to use it for work. And I love even more that these two match perfectly. So that is my entire week of work outfits. That is what I have worn in the last week. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.